need some coffee. I have been feeling so groggy all day and I decided for some reason at five o'clock in the afternoon, I need to go get some coffee. Keep hearing something about this pumpkin spice latte that everyone is craving. I'm gonna go try it. I don't usually drink Starbucks. I have my own coffee that has lots of shots of espresso in it and that's my favorite coffee or just plain black coffee in general, but Everybody swears by this coffee. It is the staple for this time of the year. So I'm gonna go and try it. I'm a potential candidate to be getting one of those coffees. I'm wide uh, enough. I think I could take it. I think I, this coffee would be the best coffee for me, right? Right? I got the drink and I have all the pumpkin smelling stuff coming through the latte right now as we speak. It smells all right, but we're getting away from here because people were making fun of me. I think people were taking videos of me. Basic white guy coming into the drive-thru getting a pumpkin spice latte and it's just like, what are you doing, bro? And I'm like, don't take my man card away, please. Now I can actually drink this coffee in peace and not get laughed at. All right, so here's the coffee. Apparently this is what they call a grande. My whole hand is about the size of the cup or about as long as the cup. I never understand the sizes at Starbucks. That's part of the reason why I never get Starbucks is because I do not know what the sizes mean. Grande is tall or big, you know, it's supposed to be big. No, no, th this is a grande, th th this is that size. Apparently venti is the taller size, which is about like to here, like, almost double the entire cup. Also, I just don't really care for their coffee. I think it's way overrated, to be honest with you. Coming from the guy who eats a Chick-fil-A. Let's, let's open this up and see what the contents are. Wow, that looks like ass. Look at what all is in there. Oh yeah, that looks delicious. It's not even full all the way up to the top of the cup. Well, there was my little bit of whipped cream that apparently I had inside of this. So yeah, it looks like pretty much pumpkin slop because, well, <laughs> That's basically what it turned out to be. I don't exactly know why that it turned out to be pumpkin slop. I don't think it was because of the driving. Is this supposed to be coffee? So I'm tasting the pumpkin, all right? So the pumpkin is definitely there. I'm tasting the pumpkin spice, which is also definitely there. It's very pumpkin-y and it's very spicy. It tastes like you're deep-throating a pumpkin. Now, I mean, don't get me wrong, if that's what you're into, then that's what you're into, but I personally don't see myself wanting to deep-throat pumpkin. Maybe I'm not wearing the right attire, but I've come prepared. We're going to change into that attire, and we're gonna see if that's going to help out with the Starbucks drink. Now I'm in the right attire. You need to stay comfy and cozy and warm. It's like 77 degrees outside right now. I'm also wearing shorts and flip-flops. This takes me back to a simpler time of pumpkin spice lattes. The pumpkin spice latte has become this phenomenon from all of the Caucasian women in this world. And to them I say, it's not that great. Okay, I get it. Yeah, we're in fall. It's it's fall now. We, we all like the pumpkin stuff. We're getting ready for Halloween. Pumpkins are everywhere. And it, you stuff like that. You're hyped about this. You're really hyped about this drink right here. This drink is not that great. What is this, Starbucks? Yes, I'm, I'm talking to you, stupid face. Maybe I'm the wrong gender. Maybe I don't know what it's like to have grown up with pumpkin spice lattes all the time. But what I can say is I give that a four out of 10 because at least it's a latte and at least it has pumpkin in it. For the taste, that's what had brought it down because the taste is not that great. I really do not understand it. I'm wearing a hoodie and it's hot outside and I turn up my AC because it was getting hot in here. What have we learned from this excursion today about the pumpkin spice lattes from Starbucks. Absolutely nothing. They just, they're they're a big fad that everybody is wanting and it, it's not that good, sorry.